Hey there, future farmers. Have you ever imagined growing fresh, delicious food without using any soil? It might sound like something out of a science fiction movie, but it's a real thing and it's called hydroponics. Hydroponics is a fun and exciting way to grow plants. Instead of soil, the plants get their food from nutrient-rich water. This water is delivered directly to the roots so the plants can grow bigger and faster. Plus, you can grow hydroponically indoors or outdoors all year round. Hydroponic gardening offers a bunch of benefits for beginners. It's a clean and efficient way to grow your favorite fruits, vegetables, and herbs. You don't need a lot of space. And you can enjoy fresh homegrown food all year round. Ready to learn more? Let's dive in. Okay, so how does this whole hydroponics thing work? It's actually pretty simple. Remember how plants normally get their food from the soil? Well, in hydroponics, we're basically giving the plants a direct line to their food source, water. We use a special growing medium like clay pebbles or cocoa coir to support the plant's roots. Then, we give the plants a special mix of water and nutrients. This nutrient solution is like a super-powered drink that helps the plants grow big and strong. Since the plants don't have to work as hard to find food, they can focus their energy on growing bigger, tastier fruits and veggies. It's a win-win. Now that you know how hydroponics works, let's talk about the different types of systems you can choose from. Don't worry, it's not as complicated as it sounds. Deep Water Culture, or DWC, is one of the easiest and most popular systems for beginners. The plant roots grow in a container filled with nutrient-rich water, and an air pump provides oxygen to the roots. The wick system is another simple system that uses a wick to draw a nutrient solution up to the plant roots. It's perfect for beginners and small plants. The Nutrient Film Technique, or NFT, involves a thin film of nutrient solution constantly flowing over the plant roots. It's a bit more advanced, but it's great for growing leafy greens and herbs. There are other hydroponic systems out there, but these three are great for beginners. The best system for you will depend on the space you have, your budget, and what you want to grow. Ready to get your hands dirty? Well, not literally dirty, since we're talking about hydroponics. Hydroponic gardening is a clean, efficient, and innovative way to grow plants without soil. But you will need a few essential tools to get started. These tools will help you create the perfect environment for your plants to thrive. A growing container is where your plants will live. It's crucial to choose the right container to ensure your plants have enough space to grow. You can use plastic tubs, buckets, or even repurposed containers. The key is to ensure they are clean and have proper drainage. A growing medium provides support for the plant roots and helps retain moisture. It also allows for better oxygenation and nutrient absorption. Popular options include clay pebbles, cocoa coir, and rock wool. Each medium has its own benefits, so choose one that suits your needs. An air pump and air stone are essential for providing oxygen to the plant roots in systems like DWC. This helps prevent root rot and promotes healthy growth. The nutrient solution is the special food that your plants will need to thrive. It contains all the essential minerals and nutrients. You can buy pre-made solutions or mix your own. Mixing your own allows for customization based on the specific needs of your plants. A pH meter helps you measure the acidity or alkalinity of your nutrient solution, which is important for optimal plant growth. Keeping the pH in the right range ensures nutrient availability. You might also need some additional tools depending on the type of system you choose, like a water pump for an NFT system. Each system has its own set of requirements. But don't worry, we'll cover those details later. With the right tools and a bit of knowledge, you'll be well on your way to a successful hydroponic garden. Section 5. Setting up your first hydroponic system, a step-by-step -step guide. Now for the fun part, setting up your very own hydroponic garden. This is an exciting journey where you'll see the magic of growing plants without soil right in the comfort of your home. Let's keep it simple and start with a basic deep water culture or DWC system. This method is perfect for beginners because it's straightforward and highly effective. Step 1. Prepare your container. Clean your container thoroughly and make sure it's watertight. This step is crucial to prevent any leaks and ensure a healthy environment for your plants. Drill holes in the lid for the net pots that will hold your plants. Make sure the holes are evenly spaced to give each plant enough room to grow. Step 2. Add your growing medium. Fill the net pots with your chosen growing medium. This medium will support your plants and help retain moisture. Clay pebbles are a great option for beginners. They are lightweight, reusable, and provide excellent aeration for the roots. Step 3. Prepare your nutrient solution. 
fill your container with water and add the appropriate amount of nutrient solution according to the instructions. This solution is vital as it provides all the essential nutrients your plants need to thrive. Step 4. Plant your seedlings. Gently remove your seedlings from their starter trays and place them in the net pots. Handle them with care to avoid damaging the delicate roots. Make sure the roots are submerged in the nutrient solution. This ensures they have constant access to water and nutrients. Step 5. Set up your air pump. Place the air stone in the bottom of the container and connect it to the air pump. The air pump will oxygenate the water which is crucial for root health. Turn on the air pump to provide oxygen to the roots. And that's it. Your hydroponic system is now up and running. You've just set up your first hydroponic system. Congratulations! This system will allow you to grow fresh, healthy plants all year round. Now sit back, relax, and watch your plants grow. Enjoy the fruits of your labor and the beauty of your new indoor garden. Section 6. Choosing the best plants for your hydroponic garden. One of the best things about hydroponics is that you can grow almost any type of plant. But some plants are easier to grow hydroponically than others, especially for beginners. Here are a few beginner-friendly plants. Leafy greens, lettuce, spinach, kale, and arugula are all great choices. They grow quickly and don't require a lot of space. Herbs, basil, mint, parsley, and cilantro are all easy to grow hydroponically. Strawberries? Yes, you can even grow strawberries hydroponically. They'll need a bit more support, but they're definitely worth the effort. Once you get the hang of it, you can experiment with growing other types of plants, like tomatoes, peppers, and even cucumbers. Section 7. Feeding Your Plants A Guide to Hydroponic Nutrients Just like humans, plants need a balanced diet to thrive. In hydroponics, we provide those essential nutrients through the nutrient solution. Hydroponic nutrients come in two main forms, liquid and powder. Liquid nutrients are pre-mixed and ready to use, while powder nutrients need to be dissolved in water. The most important nutrients for plant growth are nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium. These are often listed on nutrient solutions as NPK ratios. It's important to choose a nutrient solution that's specifically designed for hydroponics and to follow the instructions carefully. Section 8. Lights, Camera, Action. Creating the perfect environment for your plants. Light is another crucial factor for plant growth. In hydroponics we can use artificial lights to provide the right spectrum and intensity of light that plants need to thrive. The most common types of grow lights are fluorescent lights, LED grow lights and high-intensity discharge or HIID lights. In addition to light, you'll also need to consider temperature and humidity. Most plants prefer temperatures between 65 and 75 degrees Fahrenheit or 18 to 24 degrees Celsius and humidity levels around 40 to 60%. Section 9. Common Hydroponic Mistakes and How to Avoid Them Hydroponics is a fun and rewarding way to grow your own food, but it does come with its own set of challenges. Whether you're a beginner or have some experience, it's important to be aware of the common pitfalls that can hinder your success. Here are a few common mistakes that beginners make and how to avoid them to ensure a thriving hydroponic garden. Overwatering or Underwatering one of the biggest challenges in hydroponics is finding the right balance of water. Unlike traditional soil gardening, hydroponics requires precise water management. Overwatering can lead to root rot, which is a common issue that can severely damage your plants. On the other hand, underwatering can stunt plant growth and reduce yields. Invest in a moisture meter to help you keep track of your plant's water needs. This tool can be invaluable in maintaining the right moisture levels. Nutrient Deficiencies or Toxicities Plants need a balanced diet of nutrients to thrive. In hydroponics, the nutrient solution is the lifeline of your plants. Too much or too little of a particular nutrient can lead to problems such as yellowing leaves or nutrient burn. Use a quality nutrient solution and monitor your plants for signs of deficiencies or toxicities. Regularly check the pH and EC levels to ensure your plants are getting the right nutrients. Pests and Diseases just like plants grown in soil, hydroponic plants can be susceptible to pests and diseases. These can quickly spread and cause significant damage if not addressed promptly. Inspect your plants regularly and take steps to prevent and control pests and diseases. Use organic or chemical treatments as necessary to keep your plants healthy. By being aware of these common mistakes and taking proactive measures, you can increase your chances of hydroponic success and enjoy a bountiful harvest. Section 10. How much does it cost to start a hydroponic garden? The cost of starting a hydroponic garden can vary depending on the size and complexity of the system you choose. 
A basic DWC system can be set up for as little as $50, while a more elaborate system with automated features can cost several hundred dollars. However, it's important to remember that hydroponics can save you money in the long run. You'll be able to grow more food in less space, reduce your water usage, and enjoy fresh homegrown produce all year round. Section 11. The Benefits of Hydroponic Farming, Growing More with Less Hydroponic farming offers a wide range of benefits for both the environment and the grower. Increased Yields Hydroponic plants can grow up to 20% faster and produce higher yields compared to traditional soil-based gardening. Water Conservation Hydroponic systems use up to 90% less water than traditional gardening methods. Year-round growing Hydroponics allows you to grow food indoors regardless of the weather or season. Reduced Pesticide Use since hydroponic plants are grown in a controlled environment, there's less risk of pests and diseases, reducing the need for pesticides. By embracing hydroponics, we can grow more food with fewer resources, making it a sustainable and efficient way to feed the world. Section 12, Hydroponic Heroes Inspiring Stories of Success Meet Sarah, a busy mom of two who always struggled to get her kids to eat their vegetables. She decided to try hydroponic gardening and now her kids can't get enough of their homegrown lettuce and tomatoes, and then there's John, a retired teacher who turned his passion for gardening into a thriving hydroponic business. He now supplies fresh, locally grown produce to restaurants and farmers markets in his community. These are just a few examples of the many people who are discovering the joys and benefits of hydroponic gardening. With a little effort and a lot of passion, you too can join the hydroponic revolution and grow your own food your way.